to Glasgow and this travel vlog this weekend. Bill and I are heading to Glasgow to see Cadillac Green and Whiskey Mars at concert for his birthday. And we're staying at the Grasshoppers Hotel in the city centre. And yeah, we're going to be there for like about two and a half days. So we're really looking forward to it. Uh, we're just in that there. We're in the middle of waiting on our Oscar Friday. It's Oscar Friday, so we're going to be Oscar Friday. So that's our for the day. Time to tuck in. I don't know how I feel about beans on my Oscar fry though. It's not right. So we've arrived safe and sound in Glasgow after a very short plane journey and an even shorter bus journey. We just got the bus from the airport which is only like 10 minutes. And we got left off at Central Station and the hotel is actually sort of in Central Station. It's called Grasshoppers Hotel. It's like a small boutique hotel. It's really funky. It's in like a really old building. But it's new and as you can see, um, it's small and perfectly formed, but it's really funky. Funky decor, cool artwork. Oh, who's this? Bill's just checking out the loo. Small again, nice and clean, in good size shower. What do you think? Outside, we think that's you think that's the that's the train station. It's a really old train station. It's really cool looking, but look at the old radiators and everything. But I love the wallpaper. And then the girl has just showed us to her room and brought us coffee and cupcakes, all complimentary. So first impressions, would highly recommend. Apparently, you get um, Sky too. Phil's looking through, we were left at People Make Glasgow, like little um, welcome bag. Um, so we've got, as you would expect when you come to Scotland, some whiskey, is that? Is this, what else have we got? So, some news, let us know what's going on. Glasgow Art Map. Glasgow Art Map. Nice spot, Smarties too. Hmm, oh, that's nice. Oh, hey! <laughs> Very good. Um, I can say that I've like really planned our trip here. We are heading out on a Saturday night to see two bands that we love. And I picked us in at two um, award winning restaurants. We're going to, is it, we're going to like Chi Oriental tonight, which is a Cantonese restaurant. And then tomorrow night we're going to a nice Italian restaurant. So I sort of focused our trip around food. Um, but we want to hopefully do some arty stuff and plenty of shopping too. So I think we'll have some coffee and cupcakes, uh, get some energy, and then head out and explore last week. store now, you'd be happy. Might have to go into Zara first though. So we find us back at the hotel after a few hours shopping. Um, I got some jewellery, then got some t-shirts. Um, but it's just a really cool, a wee bit rainy as well so I didn't bother vlogging while we were in the boat. Uh, we've just come back to get some date, have a cup of tea before we head out to Lechi Oriental, which I'm really looking forward to. I've heard such good things about it. It's supposed to be an award winning Cantonese restaurant, I think. And the head chef is um, Jimmy Lee, who was on Great British Menu, I remember him. He was a young guy and really, really good. So I'm um, looking forward to that and having some spicy food. Phil's just enjoying his first ever Greg's pastry. 
what is up. We're at Lychee Oriental for dinner. This is our starter, Phil got ribs. And I got tofu. Beef on this. Thank you. That's very good. <laughs> Thanks so much. Almost done. Still in the West End. It started snowing. I don't like this part. Cadillac free. Let's go. So we were just back to the hotel room um, after seeing Cadillac 3 live. They were absolutely amazing. They played for an hour and a half. Um, sounded brilliant. Um, like they only have one album out. So they really did play like literally every song, which is brilliant. And the support band was Key Myers, who fell in love too. Um, weren't quite as impressive on stage. Sound, I think, a lot to do with it. It just wasn't that great. It's still amazing to see them. Um, but then he played for like 30 minutes. But it was really, really good. So we just walked back, it's like a 15 minute walk. Um, it's so cold, but we're just going to bed now. So it's our last day in Glasgow, um, we're just, we've just got ready. Um, we're going to go for breakfast, but we're also streaming the tennis because Andy Murray is in the final of the Australian Open against Djokovic. So we were like, it's pretty perfect if we're here in Glasgow and he wins it. I'd love him to win the Australian Open, he's never won before. Um, Phil and I are big tennis fans and uh, big Andy Murray fans. But at the minute he's in trouble, he's losing the first set. Uh, so I think we're going to escape, go for breakfast, come back and hope that he's winning in the second set. Have to watch it on the little screen. Come on, Andy. Tennis is over, Andy lost. We've come to join our sorrows and spend our last day shopping. We're in the Canon Quarter in Glasgow, which is supposed to be a brilliant shopping destination.
Bridge and we're going to Bread Meets Bread. I love about this place. Just do awesome burgers. Um, so without further ado, let's see what we're all about.